The American Revolution was a time of great change. It was a fight for freedom from Great Britain. The 13 American colonies wanted to govern themselves. They were tired of the king's rules. The colonists felt like they weren't being treated fairly. They wanted a say in their own government. This desire for freedom would lead to a war, a war that would change the world. The Boston Tea Party was a key event in American history, marking a significant turning point in the relationship between the British crown and the American colonies. In 1773, a group of colonists, frustrated and angered by British policies, took a bold step. They boarded ships in Boston Harbor and threw an entire shipment of tea overboard. This dramatic act was a protest against the Tea Act, a law that imposed a tax on tea and granted the British East India Company a monopoly on the American tea trade. King George III, the reigning monarch at the time, was infuriated by this blatant act of defiance. He saw it as a direct challenge to his authority and the rule of British law in the colonies. The British East India Company, a powerful entity with significant influence, was deeply involved in the tea trade. They had been granted exclusive rights to sell tea in the colonies, which meant that colonists had no choice but to buy from them. This monopoly was seen as deeply unfair by the colonists, who believed it infringed on their rights and economic freedom. They were forced to pay a tax on tea, a commodity they consumed daily. The anger and resentment among the colonists grew, leading to widespread protests and a growing sense of unity against British rule. The Boston Tea Party was a manifestation of this collective frustration. By dumping the tea into the harbor, the colonists sent a powerful message to King George and the British government. They were willing to take drastic measures to defend their rights and oppose what they saw as unjust laws. The Boston Tea Party was not just about tea, it was about the principle of self-governance and the fight for liberty. In 1776, the colonists took a bold step. They were frustrated with the British rule, which imposed heavy taxes and restrictive laws without giving them any representation in the British Parliament. This growing discontent led to a revolutionary spirit among the colonists. They declared their independence from Great Britain. This was not a decision made lightly. It was the result of years of mounting tensions and conflicts, including events like the Boston Tea Party and the Battles of Lexington and Concord. This document is known as the Declaration of Independence. It was a groundbreaking proclamation that outlined the colony's reasons for seeking independence and their vision for a new nation. It stated that all men are created equal. This was a radical idea at the time, challenging the traditional hierarchies and monarchies that dominated the world. Thomas Jefferson was the main author. He was a brilliant thinker and writer, chosen for his eloquence and ability to articulate the colony's aspirations. He wrote about the rights to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. These words have since become a cornerstone of American values, symbolizing the nation's commitment to individual freedoms and human rights. This document was a powerful statement. It was read aloud in public squares and meeting places, inspiring the colonists and rallying them to the cause of independence. It showed the world that the colonies were now the United States of America. This declaration marked the birth of a new nation, one founded on the principles of freedom, equality, and democracy. The impact of the Declaration of Independence was profound, not only in America but around the world, as it inspired other movements for freedom and self-determination. The battles of Lexington and Concord were very important. In 1775, British troops marched to Concord, Massachusetts. They wanted to seize colonial weapons. However, the colonists were ready for a fight. At Lexington, the first shots of the war were fired. The fighting continued at Concord. These battles showed the colonists' determination. They were willing to fight and die for their freedom. A Section 5. No Taxation Without Representation This phrase became a rallying cry for the American colonists in the 18th century. It encapsulated their frustration and anger towards the British government. One of the main causes of the revolution was a disagreement about taxes. The British government had imposed a series of taxes on the colonies, including the Stamp Act and the Townshend Acts. These taxes were meant to help pay off the debt from the French and Indian War and to fund the ongoing protection of the colonies. The colonists believed they should not be taxed without representation in Parliament. They had no elected representatives in the British Parliament, and therefore, they felt they had no voice in the decisions that affected their lives and livelihoods.
this lack of representation was seen as a violation of their rights as Englishmen. They argued that it was unfair for the British government to impose taxes on them. The colonists felt that they were being treated as second-class citizens, subject to the whims of a distant government that did not understand or care about their needs and concerns. The British government argued that the colonies benefited from British protection. They pointed out that British soldiers had defended the colonies during the French and Indian War and continued to protect them from potential threats. They felt that the colonies should help pay for that protection. The British government believed that it was only fair for the colonies to contribute to the costs of their own defense and administration. This disagreement over taxes would be a major factor leading to war. The colonists' resentment grew as they continued to be taxed without representation, and their protests became more organized and widespread. Events such as the Boston Tea Party and the Intolerable Acts further inflamed tensions. Ultimately, these disputes over taxation and representation would culminate in the outbreak of the American Revolution, a conflict that would change the course of history and lead to the birth of a new nation. Section 6. Unfair Rules from Afar The colonists also resented British colonial policies. They felt that these policies were designed to benefit Great Britain at the expense of the colonies. They wanted more control over their own affairs. The British government imposed restrictions on colonial trade. They also limited the westward expansion of the colonies. These policies angered the colonists and fueled their desire for independence. Section 7. General George Washington takes command. George Washington played a pivotal role in the American Revolution. He was appointed commander-in-chief of the Continental Army. His leadership and determination were instrumental in the colonists' victory. Washington faced many challenges during the war. He had to overcome shortages of supplies and troops. He also had to contend with British military superiority. Despite these challenges, he never lost sight of the ultimate goal, independence. Section 8. Jefferson's Words, Franklin's Wit Thomas Jefferson and Benjamin Franklin were also key figures. Jefferson, as we've seen, wrote the Declaration of Independence. Franklin was a skilled diplomat. He helped secure an alliance with France. Franklin was a respected figure in Europe. He convinced the French that supporting the American colonies was in their best interest. The French alliance provided the colonists with much-needed military and financial assistance. Section 9. A New Nation Emerges After a long and hard-fought war, the colonists were victorious. They defeated the British and secured their independence. The Treaty of Paris officially ended the war in 1783. The newly formed United States of America faced many challenges. They had to establish a new government and rebuild their economy. However, they were determined to create a nation based on freedom and liberty. Section 10. The Legacy of 1776 The American Revolution had a profound impact on the world. It inspired other countries to fight for their own freedom. It also showed that it was possible to overthrow a powerful empire. The revolution left a lasting legacy of democracy and self-government. The United States became a beacon of hope for those seeking freedom and opportunity. Section 11. Why the Revolution Matters The American Revolution is an important part of history. It reminds us that freedom is worth fighting for. It also teaches us about the importance of standing up for what we believe in. The revolution shaped the United States into the nation it is today. It is a story of courage, determination, and the pursuit of a dream, a dream of a better tomorrow.